One of the best traditions of college sports is, of course, the band. They're the hype factor for every college team. But we learned today one of the school's bands was unable to travel with their team to Spokane for March Madness. So a local band is stepping up. Jordan Smith has the story. Well, Yale's marching band was unable to travel with their squad here to Spokane, but then U of I's band heard about that, learned the fight song, got on a bus, and is here in Spokane to represent the Yale Bulldogs. Are you guys ready for March Madness? <laughs> The Bulldogs band sounds and looks a little different today. We got a call from our athletics department on Sunday saying, hey, Yale's band couldn't make it with the University of Idaho Vandal band like to step in and it just worked out where we could come up and play. The sound of Idaho got to work, quickly learning the Yale fight song ahead of their battle with Auburn today. We got the music this morning, so I mean, we learned it and I think we sound pretty good. They loaded up on the bus and hit the road, gearing up for one of the biggest venues in college sports. It's a cool opportunity and it's cool that like, we were chosen out of all the other bands in the Pacific Northwest. So, and it's, all, it's always cool helping out another school. The Vandals even looked the part today, trading their Vandal gold for Yale blue. But there were subtle cameos of Vandal Pride today. You know, we're sneakily representing U of I, though. We're here to help our friends from Yale. But we might write a few new lyrics to the Vandal fight song. Because of NCAA regulations, I couldn't film the band inside the arena. So they gave me a sneak peek of what the fans could expect. Masking the Vandal fight song with some Bulldog pride. Another illustration of what makes March Madness so special. In Spokane, Jordan Smith, 4 News Now. So much fun. Thank you, Jordan. And because Yale won today, the Idaho band is sticking around and they will be here Sunday to support the Yale Bulldogs.